Right, so I just finished uh, editing my thank you video for, well, basically an update for the cat as well, but, uh, you know, I'm, I'm was feeling good, feeling dandy, everything was awesome, but then I stumbled over, oh, hang on, I can change this thing, I mean, it's like I'm live streaming. It, this, this fellow, uh, moist, cynical, moist critical, uh, Charles, Charlie, something. Well, the title of this video is, This Scam is Killing Cats. So let's let's just say that my blood blood is a little bit riled up right now. Yeah, apparently there's a a litter box for cats, you know, an automatic litter box thingy that is killing cats. So uh, that's something. I'll leave a link to the like Charlie's video over here. I mean, I'm sure Asmongold will react to it at some point. But yeah, I also stated in my thank you video that uh, it's it, it's still the same day. My wife is currently at her grandmother's, so I have time to clean the house, and I'm currently, you know, building up energy in order to start. But yeah, I mean, I'm just relaxing for a little bit, and I'm gonna get to it real soon. Now, right, well, talking about energy drinks, uh, because I did a little bit of an experiment for the last couple of days. Well, for the last three days, I've had zero energy drinks, which caused me immeasurable pain, oh, well, a little bit of a headache and, you know, all the other chemicals that my body craves, so that's something. Yeah, but, um, I uh, I got a sip this morning, I went to the store early, quite early, got myself a Red Bull, and it just changed my life. Uh, I'm severely addicted. Again, not the worst thing to be addicted to, but uh, it's expensive and it's bad for me. But boy, does it taste good. <laughs> uh, well, so this video is basically just going to be a rambling video because I have not posted a lot lately. I managed to keep a daily upload for a very long time. I'm also closing in on a thousand subscribers. Now, the one thing that I... <coughs> excuse me. The one thing that I could do in order to increase my subscribers and such is, well, make better content. I'm wearing shorts, by the way. I'm not, you know, doing this in my underwear. Uh, but, yeah... I could make better content and I could also make short videos, but the problem is that uh, I don't like shorts anymore, yeah. and it has also been recommended to me that I should start making, you know, a Twitter or X, whatever it's called now. Now I've never had a Twitter, I've never even had a Reddit, uh, I only have a Facebook, and honestly I do want to get rid of that, but, well, I had to get a Facebook in order to stay in touch with friends after I moved basically across country, and but it's not really useful for me other than that, so well, I think I was making a point. But yeah, three days without any energy drinks, that was something. Uh, I don't think I will be able to, I'm trying to cut back a little, so that's definitely something. Now, I also did another weird experiment that really <laughs> became a problem uh, for the last, uh, well, uh, now it's a couple of days, but I did not eat anything for three days. I drank a lot of liquids, I did, but I just wanted to see if I could manage it. My wife was really worried, she threatened to call my mother, which kind of worked, uh, but yeah, yeah, I'm, um, I'm just a little bit all over the place now, have a little bit of an existential crisis, I would say, I mean, I'm, I guess that's putting it a little bit too far, or going too far, but I'm currently applying for jobs again. I mean, I'm gone a little bit on and off since currently I am on parental leave and I can't really work right now until November, but I I need a job. I, I need money. And something that I haven't really talk, talked too much about is my fin financial, financial situation, if I even can speak of this. I'm not sure how much of this is going in the video, but yeah, I'm like, I don't really have much income. Basically, everything that I get in goes out. So, yeah, I mean, technically, I am poor, close to broke. This is not a video asking for money, and the reason why is because, well, I have a roof over my head, my daughter is fed, my cat is fed, <coughs> I am fed, I have enough. I mean, I really shouldn't, because this, like, I have enough for energy drinks, even though I should stop because it's bad for you. <sighs> but, yeah, I really need to find a way to make money. Now, I am very close to a thousand subscribers, which means that once I hit that, I can start to monetize my videos, but that also means ads. And I'm not too much of a fan of ads, and the reason I'm not a fan of it is because the ads that you are served are 
well, not stuff that you're interested in. If all of my ads were for video games, I would be all for it. Maybe some computer parts, I do like that. Maybe some fun cat toys. Well, except for the, you know, the killer litter box that is currently on the loose. I'm not gonna make, make a video of that. I mean, like, Charlie over here is doing a proper job. I mean, he's reacting to another video who made the proper thing, like reaction videos and such. I'm not gonna get into that, but yeah. So I think that this video is just gonna be me rambling. Ooh, speaking of rambling, I don't think I'm, I have made any points even. This is just me talking. I'm probably just gonna call this video rambling about nothing. That I, today, before I made the thank you video, actually, at the same time as I made the thank you video with, uh, you know, the lists and all this stuff, I was on hold with customer service uh, for an hour. <laughs> uh, the carrier, wagon, stroller, baby stroller, that uh, me and my wife used for my daughter. Uh, we were in in the store a month a month ago, and my wife noticed that one of the wheels were was loose, almost falling off. So when we got home again, I tried to touch the wheel, and it basically just disintegrated in my hands. Everything just fell off, and uh, yeah, we sent in a complaint to uh, the place that we ordered it from. Now that was a month ago, <laughs> and I called them today. I, when I called them, they said that the estimated estimated wait time was 16 minutes, but 58 minutes later I got an answer, and the answer that I got was, yeah, we're gonna like talk to the people who made the stroller, and that was it. We had to wait longer. Uh, but, uh, but if my daughter would have been in the stroller when the wheel. F uh, fell off, I would probably have a totally different tone. Uh, and if you watched my videos long enough, you know that I'm not really quick to anger. I'm not, I uh, mean, if my daughter would have gotten hurt, uh, there, there would have been a totally different issue, but... Yeah, so that was the start of the day. Then again, the start of the day was my cat bringing in, uh, bringing in a dead mouse in the house, so that's, <laughs> that, that was something. I'm probably gonna post this video, like, the day after that video, so it means yesterday, but who knows. Uh, yeah, so I was on hold for an hour. Oh, didn't get any answers. Uh, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Right, okay, I'm just uh, relaxing a little bit, trying to think what I need to do. The plan for today is that I'm going to clean up the entire house, do some vacuuming, and then I need to handle the bathroom. Actually, I might as well show what I'm planning to do. Give me a second. Now, I could do this the good old style of just, you know, going on the floor with a rag and such, but I do have this thing. <laughs> oh, hopefully that wasn't too loud, but uh, a little bit of a drill and one of these extensions and then I'm gonna thoroughly clean the entire bathroom. Did I even talk about... yeah, I'm not in the right mindset of making a video, but uh, I'm, 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 I'm just not, so this is probably gonna be a horrible video, maybe. Some people like to listen to my voice, so... Here, <laughs> uh, here it is. But yeah, a lot of people wanted me to... well... Uh, people who are in close proximity wanted me to start up a Patreon and all that kind of stuff in order to actually finance these videos. Now, the problem with with that is, if I were to make a Patreon, I would have to put content there that is, you know, worth it. And I'm gonna be frank, I think that my videos have gotten a lot better since I started at the start of this year, but they're... I don't really think that they're worth money. <laughs> uh, like... I, I wouldn't want anyone to pay for this video, per se. Just me rambling, unless I have actually something to offer, other than just, you know, complaining about stuff. I also want to stop complaining as much. Uh, because even though I'm a little bit uh, screwed up in the brain, because of, you know, basically money, and sure, some other is issues, I'm not gonna get into that, especially not now. But, yeah, I'm, I'm actually in a good place. Even though <laughs> I don't have any money. Uh... But yeah, I have a daughter, another baby on the way, I have a wife and a cat, a roof over my head, and I'm, I'm not starving. Even though I tried to starve a little bit, but just basically to see how it was. Ooh, yeah, I haven't told that story before. Yeah, my first year of college, my freshman year of college, I attempted to save as much money as possible. Now, I've stated before, 
I think, in one video or something, that I saved up $30,000 before I started college, just so that I didn't have to work while I was getting my education. No, I worked a little bit on the side to, uh, like, building on computers and doing some minor code, like web development and such, but yeah, I wanted to save as much money as I could, so I spent a total of $30 a month on food. Now, for some, that may be a lot, but in my country, that is uh, that is nothing. That is basically nothing. Like this can right here, that's five bucks. Ugh. But yeah, I was living on solely dry noodles. <laughs> I mean, that's the uh, college diet for a lot of people, like instant ramen. Uh, but the thing is, uh, like, I, I ate them raw. I didn't even boil them. So, yeah, I was extremely thin back then, malnourished you could say. I have a picture on somewhere, I don't remember where, um, but yeah, and, uh, you could really see, see my cheekbones. Right now you can't because, well, the, the flubber. <laughs> uh, oh, but boy, that, that was something. That was extremely fun until my mother discovered how little I spent on food. And then she, well, this is gonna, gonna sound weird, but yeah, she threatened to send me money for food. And my mother is retired, she doesn't have much money. So yeah, I just said, no, no, I have the money. <laughs> I can spend money on food. So I started, you know, actually buying food and preparing meals uh, multiple times a day, which is a little bit of a lie since I only ate once a day. But but but, but still, uh, it, it, it got better. But yeah, for about a year, maybe a little bit more, I only spent $30 a month on food. That does not include energy drinks, sadly. Yes. And I was also working out quite a lot, so I was, you know, using protein powder, which helped. And about once a month, I went to uh, Mickey D's, McDonald's, and just, uh, well, got all of my fats and salts and the stuff that I needed to grow my body, basically. But, uh, yeah. I don't remember what this rant was gonna be about. I'm just sitting here, alone in my house, trying to build up enough energy to start cleaning. There's a lot of stuff that needs to be done. My wife has told me that I don't need to do anything, but I did, like I should do something. I need to do something. Yeah, and also talking about working out. Like I've shown in multiple videos and also my setup tour that I have dumbbells right underneath me. I mean, I have them on my feet here. here. These handsome little bastards, yeah, I, I do need to start working out again. Not for the sake of uh, really myself, but I mean, I'm strong enough to carry my daughter all day, every day, which is fine, but I mean, I don't have muscles. Like, there's basically nothing compared to what it was. I'm not trying to brag or anything. I mean, I have a little bit, but um, I have a rather large fig figure, which I could be a lot bigger, especially I could be a lot stronger, and I do need to work on my stamina because I get tired way too easily. I've already ranted for a good 15 minutes. <laughs> oh boy. Well, this video is probably not gonna go too well since I'm just rambling about random stuff, but I mean, who knows? I made a few points. I don't think I've finished a single one. Oh boy, I'm gonna have a fun time editing this thing and just what the hell am I doing? It's probably not even gonna be a video. And if it is, well, there we go. <laughs> Welcome to my channel. Sometimes I post gaming videos, sometimes I post random stuff like this. Uh, I mean, I could have spent this entire video just reacting to uh, Mr. Moist Critical over here. Cynical? Oh, hang on. Oh, Penguin Zero? What's his name? I mean, oh, okay, that's a lot of views. It was posted 14 hours ago, already have 1.7 million views. I should do this, hang on. I mean, he's sitting here and talking about it in his beautiful monotone voice. Now, I don't watch a lot of uh, stuff like this, but it's uh, like it's fun to have in the background. Oh, not a thing that happened recently in the news, it was the whole, hang on. Yeah, this also happened in YouTube history. Nikocado Avocado. All of a sudden, he's thin. If you don't know this fella, he's, uh, you know, a mukbang con content creator. Mukbang is basically where you eat on camera. That has never been something that I watched, but I knew of this guy. Which is kind of funny, because I did have a documentary of about him, like, a couple of days ago. Just uh, in the background while I was playing with my daughter. Like, you know, apparently he was down bad and stuff like this, and then all of a sudden he posts a video of him being thin, and yeah, it's, uh, apparently I'm one of the 
ends. Now, I also never talked about uh, my prior employer, which was, well, it had nothing to do with programming or anything. It was basically just selling stuff, but yeah, they were going out of business. Karma! <laughs> Oh, but yeah. Is this entertaining? Does anyone find it entertaining that I'm just rambling like this? I mean, I'll, I'll obviously edit the video, so I'm just not sitting here in silence. So that's something. Listen to pe people talk about nothing. Now, this is probably not gonna be like a viral video. I highly doubt that. <laughs> oh, I want to play in Shrouded. Oh, I want to play Black w uh, Myth Wukong. There's also a couple of other games going on. Like right now, Black Myth Wukong nearly has 600,000 reviews, and they're overwhelmingly positive. There's also Baldur's Gate. Uh, I mean, there's also a few games that I'm looking forward to, like the new Dying Light game, not sure when that comes out, and also uh, Crimson Desert, which is uh, from the developers of Black Desert Online. Oh, one thing that I could mention, I mean, again, since this is a weird video, I've also been watching a little bit of DSP. Now, where's that little bastard? Darkseid Phil, one of the OGs of YouTube. Yeah, this little weirdo. <laughs> yeah, Darkseid Phil. It's, uh, he's a weird one. I've been watching him since, well, I was in high school, basically. He's one of the first gaming YouTubers, like, ever. And then he had, like, a bunch of haters, I'm not really sure why, but again, I stopped watching YouTube, focusing on my degree and uh, social life, which, I mean, I could rather have posted videos of my own. I mean, he's quite a bit older than me, I think. He's like in his 40s, maybe? I mean, but then again, not that much older. I'm in my 30s, so uh, yeah. But I do think about that quite a lot, that I could have started early. Er, a lot earlier, <laughs> because my first video that I posted on YouTube, I did that in 2009. I think that's my earliest video, and the earliest video that I have on this channel is from 2010. It's, uh, it was either Call of Duty or Mortal Kombat. Uh, it was one of the two. But yeah, those videos are privated, for, well, because I used copyrighted music. Because I was, you know, I was young, didn't really know any better. Yeah, so I've been watching him because he's on the redemption arc right now, which is kind of fun. Other than that, yeah. I mean, I think this video was es essentially just me trying to explain why there haven't been that much videos from me. I mean, I've stated that multiple times already, that I don't have the time. I mean, maybe I get an hour when my daughter is asleep that I can actually play, but then I also need to edit the video. And I've also been playing quite a lot of Seven Days to Die with the wife. Most of it without recording, just because, well, it's more fun for me and the wife when we can just talk. I mean, we could and we plan to do that in the future. Uh, she wants to make a video of her own just to see how it goes, basically. But she doesn't want me in the room because she's... Uh, I'm, not, I'm not sure she's a little bit shy. I'm not sure if she, if she wants to be on camera. She's been on camera multiple times. She's... <laughs> I mean, most of the time she's in my video. Somehow she can just walk by. I mean, because I don't have a green screen, I'm using the NVIDIA broadcast uh, thingamajig, so that removes the background. A lot of the time, if I move a little bit, you can see the background. I mean, it works fairly good. It's a little bit buggy from time to time, but it's good enough. So yeah, we do plan to actually make a couple videos in the future where she could talk. I mean, she doesn't have a microphone, but I do have a spare microphone somewhere, so yeah. And, I mean, I could also record her screen at the same time. I, I mean, I did that before. I did. I, I mean, her computer used to be my streaming computer uh, way back in the day when I attempted to stream. But this was like back in 2017, 2018, which is, oh, a long time ago. Huh? Uh, so hopefully, if this video <laughs> gets any views, I mean, who knows, maybe this is the future of my channel. I'm joking. I want to continue to play games. Exactly, but I did say that I may may want to make videos like this from time to time where I just ramble about nonsense. Uh, I wonder if I finished my point about not making a Patreon. Yeah, because even though I don't have a lot of money, I mean, I... Uh, I like, I, I remember when I got, uh, like, a partnership on YouTube. Like, my videos are not monetized because I like the subscribers, but I still can get members. And I've had a few members, uh, like, uh, here and there, but... The thing is, uh, I mean, I'm 
I'm not ruined necessarily. I mean, I'm never going to be able to retire if this continues, but I mean, there, there should be a job for me out there. Actually, what's in the background over there? My head. Oh, that's one of my daughter's toys or her, her stuffed animals. We will see. We will see. I mean, I really should make a Patreon or at least, I mean, I don't even have a PayPal. <sighs> but again, oh boy, do I hate asking for money. I mean, it took a lot of me to ask for financial help from the people of YouTube, from you guys. And I don't really want to do that unless I can offer something back. I mean, I'm making a lot of videos, that I am, but I, 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 again, it's just me playing games and talking about random stuff. So, yeah, I, I need to figure something out. Now, I've also watched a little bit of Who's the Feller? Offending everyone? Offending everybody? It's probably on my page here somewhere. Yeah, Offending Everybody. Because I do like myself a little bit of dark humor. And he's a YouTube animator. Makes uh, very, very good videos, I think. I mean, there's a... Uh, uh, I mean, the title is definitely correct with Offending Everybody. Yeah, I'm talking about this fella. I don't know, something is happening on my phone. Uh, just my brother sending me memes and emails from LinkedIn and other people because my email is public up there. What now? Yeah, yeah. Phones should not be allowed to do that. I open the phone because it says, it says kabloing, and then I close the phone and I get another kabloing. I mean, I never use my phone when I'm in my car. Uh, I have Bluetooth for that, but uh, right, right. Is this enough rambling? Do you want more rambling? Have you clicked off the video already? <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, the idea, idea for my YouTube channel was that I was going to make a hundred videos and then I was going to put in effort. <laughs> but, I mean, basically the opposite thing happened. I'm starting to get less and less time to actually make videos. I mean, I've already been recording for almost an hour. <laughs> and I could have spent this hour cleaning the house. But rather I'm sitting here, talking, talking to you, drinking unhealthy beverages. I mean, this is probably also why I wanted to be a streamer. Because I could just sit here and talk to people. Now, I did stream for over four months, every single day, but my daughter, you know, I, I mean, I wanted to stream at like a set time and that was not possible. I mean, I could live stream whenever my daughter is asleep, but again, I get interrupted all the time. I mean, multiple times in this video, I've I stood up and I've actually done a little bit of something. I mean, I need to actually stop recording. <laughs> in order for me to do some proper stuff, but yeah, throwing away a little bit of garbage, cleaning uh, some of my cans around here. I mean, I only have two cans on my desktop right now, because again, I haven't bought a lot of energy drinks. <sighs> and now there is also a video that I wanted to basically do where I exposed myself of how many energy drinks I've drunken, drinking, because I've uh, quite a bit of a addiction, an addiction to this, even though, I mean, it's not drugs, I mean, almost, but yeah, I've been drinking energy drinks every day since I was 12, approximately four cans a day. I think I also did the calculations that I've spent close to 80 grand, if not more, on just energy drinks. You know, those, that, that money could come in real handy right now. <laughs> uh, uh, but yeah. I could probably do a proper video of that, like with some images and like proper calculations of how much I've spent, how much I've drank, and I mean, I mentioned this in one of my Enshrouded videos. Okay, but I'm starting to feel the need to do something. Right, so I'm gonna start to clean the house. We will see if this video ever hits the light of day. Maybe it does. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be weird. Uh, right, well, I think that I'm gonna say, as always, until next time. Uh, uh, yeah. So this is what you want to do with your YouTube channel, eh, Orion? <laughs>